hi guys welcome to salesforce troop and in this video i'll show you what i have built in last couple of weeks so from last couple of weeks i was learning how to build a decentralized web application uh, in short we call it as a web3 so i have built a raise fund application that is completely a decentralized fundraising application so in this uh, i have used nextjs for front end solidity for building my contract tailwind css for designing my layout i have used hardhat hardhat is an ethereum development environment that helped me in compiling my contracts and then i have used alchemy alchemy is a blockchain development platform that provides easy access to the nodes and it also makes our building decentralized application an easy and straightforward process then for crypto i have used the polygon matic and ipfs i have used for file system so ipfs is a interplanetary file system which is a distributed system for storing an application files right because storing a big files on a blockchain is a costliest process so that's why we store our files on the ipfs and use their address and store that address on the blockchain let's see what i have built let's go to the front end so this is the application that i have built application name is raise fund this is built by nextjs that is a reactjs framework apart from that like you can see the two campaigns are running right now for this raising fund one is for raising money for environment fighting cancer there are a couple of categories that you can choose and here you have an option to connect to your wallet the wallet i'm using here is a metamask and for learning purpose i was using the test net not the main net and i have provided the themes as well like light theme you can use aqua theme night theme and the coffee theme so i really love this theme and here i can see on the campaigns the total running campaigns and if i go to the dashboard it will show me only the campaigns that i have created so it takes time to load and once it comes your campaigns and one campaign i have raised i can go and view that campaign if I go and view that campaign, so this is totally a free, uh, fresh campaign. So, campaign target is 500 Matic. Matic is our currency, and receive zero. I can donate here some amount of money to this campaign, and at the same time, I can create another campaign as well. So, let's go and create first campaign. Then I'll show you how this whole process of donation works. So let's go and click the create campaign. So, in the create campaign, I can give some title. So in title i'll put help improve children's education the target amount i can say thousand metric and it's education only raise for charity or someone else we can select this is our raising for and then description i can add some big description here i'll copy campaign description currently we are located in africa and blah blah and i can attach a file as well so i'll go and attach a file on downloads i'll select a file and now because the content as i mentioned like attaching a bigger stuff or uh, uh, deploying a bigger stuff to a blockchain is costlier so what we're gonna do is we'll take the description as well as the file upload to the ipfs so if i click on here it will deploy my description and file to ipfs you can see it successfully deployed and use that address and store into the blockchain so now i'll click on create campaign it will create a campaign and now it's asking me to connect to your wallet so i'll confirm okay this is my wallet because to deploy a contract to a blockchain or something to a blockchain we need a gas fee so i'm confirming okay you can take this is a metamask so now it take that confirmation and start deploying it so now you can see campaign created successfully is coming on to the top so the campaign has been attached to the blockchain node and here you can see it lists down our new campaign that we have created uh, the heading is coming the title the description only two lines and rest you have to if you want to read more about you can click on view the amount that is required or we are raising basically an owner owner is the long address of our uh, wallet and then date and time when this charity has been created and now if i go and do this because this i have viewed it so first i'll go uh, this i created so i'll go and view it view. and now you can see that there is no recent don donation no past donation 
uh, campaign target received amount zero description image is coming and the heading is coming so now i'm going to donate 0 0.01 and i'll hit donate again it opened my wallet metamask i'll confirm the donation and now you can see here that amount received is 0 0.01 and the recent donor is me if i connect the wallet you can see i have remaining with 0919 matic and that's my address 76 c at the end and both is 7c at the end so now let's try it with the another wallet so i'll go to my metamask i'll switch the account here i'll go to my account one i have 1.0.16 matic here and now I'll do the campaigns. And once I come here, you can see if I click on connect wallet, it will connect to my new account that I selected in MetaMask that is that has 0 0.16 Matic. And now if I click on view this to this campaign, it will that you don't have any past donation, but recently somebody has donated something now if i donate with 0 0.05 this will open my wallet again now this time you can see it comes with the count one is asking for the gas fee confirm that and now you can see that it immediately is showing me received amount that is 0 0.06 metric now total uh, recent donation happened uh, twice like previously we did now we did so two and as i count one my past donation is only one so that's coming here that's how my end-to-end -end stuff works and if i go to my dashboard here it will list down only one campaign that i am running right now that is raising money for environment because the campaign of education one is running by the another account so that's how our a decentralized web application works and it was pretty interesting application that i have built and it, there was so much learning how contracts work how blockchain works how the development happen and how all stuff so i'm pretty happy with this application i hope you like the demo of the same and thanks for watching have a lovely day